Hello my friends, how are you doing? I hope that you are doing good. Stay safe and healthy always. In today's video, I am going to share with you the topic about my brother's death due to COVID-19. I'd like to share this story with you uh, to serve as a piece of advice that although we got fully vaccinated, it doesn't mean that we are that we are very strong against uh, COVID-19. So, uh, my brother sent me his uh, photo after his vaccination, second dose. And he was very proud, really, that he got vaccinated. So needless to say I'm odds and ends, but I'll be stumbling away. Slowly learning that life is okay. Say after me, it's no better to be safe than sorry. Take on me. Take On September 9, 2021, he was rushed to the hospital due to his uh, complaint of uh, being weak. Unluckily, the hospital was full and uh, there was no chance for him to be admitted. However, there was one generous doctor who treated him at the parking lot of the hospital and he was sent for a uh, swab test. He got the result and it was positive. On the same day before he uh, left the hospital, he was given some treatment like uh, oxygen and um, he was given IV fluids and he was sent for, a, for an x-ray. And the result of the x-ray was his uh, lungs, were uh, filled with uh, phlegm, but uh, his blood pressure and blood sugar were normal. On day three, that was September 11, his oxygen level was fluctuating. Sometimes it, it reaches to uh, 82, and sometimes it's uh, 65, between 65 and 67. In the afternoon, I called up my uh, my uh, younger brother was taking was taking care of him, and he said that uh, he he got no appetite for food. He doesn't want to uh, to stand, and um, his oxygen level was very low. Almost he couldn't read. He couldn't read it. That was on day three. 